Sis guy, he a visionary. So Lil Tim, years ago, beat the hammer Tory. Old but new for you, exclusive, baby. Lil Tim made headlines in November 2020 when he was accused of killing King Von. Real name, Davon Bennett, outside of an Atlanta hookah bar. The shooting allegedly occurred during an altercation between King Von's armed and dangerous squad and Atlanta rapper Quando Rondo's crew. Although Lil Tim was arrested shortly after the shooting, he was eventually released on $100,000 bond in March 2021, according to reports of the Georgia Bureau of Investigation has since closed the case. So what's up y'all it's your girl mickey truth aka the queen of paperwork and i am back with a quick video y'all i can officially report and confirm that the murder charge against timothy leaks aka little town for the murder of rapper king von has been dismissed based on the da's decision not to prosecute i personally spoke with the clerk of court representative in fulton county that did confirm by phone that the charges has been dismissed because the da chose not to prosecute I do not have any further details if it was due to self-defense or whatever, but the reason that I was provided was due to the DA choosing not to prosecute. So yes, the charges for the murder of King Vaughn against Lil Tim, AKA Timothy Leakes are dismissed. No further actions is pending. No further actions in the murder case of King Vaughn has been provided. So at this point, that is the update. Had to come through and let y'all know. So until next time, holla. I know Sid and Nash is a punk. I already got the scoop on that nigga two years ago. I know. Now, I found out about it oh, uh, a couple weeks ago and then posted it in the community yesterday or two days ago. It doesn't really matter. I deleted it because somebody had said, oh, no, bro. They put up a fake website and had cuz in there. All right, cool. Govern your bases. Sometimes just, just live with your mistakes for anybody that's aspiring YouTube personality. <clears throat> What does this say? What does it mean? Does that mean that everybody jumping cats and everything should pull out guns and defend their homies? Nah, not necessarily. Uh, there was another guy who got arrested as well. So apparently he died. So he might have been charged with the murder as well. So we don't know that part. Uh, there is a YouTuber that's going to go down there and try to get the files on Monday. So there's that part. But the biggest thing is this, right? Learn your region. King Von obviously didn't know where the hell he was because if he did, he wouldn't have did anything like that. Also, learn your people. With King Von punching on Quando Rondo, bro, it's obvious that they jumped him. You can go and watch the video and everything like that. Them cats jumped Quando Rondo. So I don't care what these cats is hollering. Oh, man, he, this and that, this that. It don't matter. You jumped a nigga. And not only did you jump a nigga, you thought you was like that. When in reality, you can be like that. But the game at times will give you it right back. So with that being said, bro, King Von damn near got what he deserved. But also his homies let him down. Now some of y'all be like, oh, hood mentality, hood mentality, hood mentality. Unfortunately, that was the time where you wanted to go viral. Why did you want to go viral? If it would have been a one-on-one -on -one fight with Quando Rondo. I don't know what that was. With Quando Rondo. And Lil Tim, I mean, with Quando Rondo, King Von, and it just showed King Von just dog walking Quando Rondo. It would have been cool. Then nobody could have been like, hey, bro, he deserved to get shot or nothing like that because it's a one on one. People don't trip off one on ones unless you walk up, punch somebody, and you had no agreement to that, and then they pull out and they kill you. That's different. But what I will do is I'll say this even further we got to stop pretending that. Just because you like somebody, that they should be alive and the rules should be bent for them. Do I think that Lil Tim should be dead for his actions? Nah, but I've seen it happen time and time again where in the hood, niggas get to fighting and then next thing you know, shots ring off. Why is Lil Tim different? Because he got some money? Well, if he really thought about his money at that time, he'd still be here. More than likely be facing a goddamn indictment in Chicago. Not the one from... Atlanta and stuff like that. I'm just about to work on that video all night. Make sure y'all got them bells on because I'm going to just drop the video uh, tomorrow. I'm going to work on that tonight, though. I'm going to try to drop it tomorrow if I can. But either way that go, bro, that's what we're doing. That's how we operate. And when it's all said and done, 
It just is what it is, man. You can't do what you want to do and expect no repercussions. Laws don't work like that. People don't work like that. So, yeah, Vaughn might have been on Demon Time and everything like that, but now you done created the Demon Slayer. So, man, <laughs> King Vaughn, I mean, rest in peace to him, but, bruh, this happens every day. Y'all seen uh, Shaka Zulu, Ludacris manager, this same thing happened to him. He got jumped and everything like that and squeezed off rounds and killed like two people or shot four people and killed one or something like that, bro. So this is a very common thing in the South because from Illinois, I'm from California. We don't think like that. We think if you do something like that, it's still legal. So typically I'm a clutch and you're going to clutch and then we'll let it off at each other and it wouldn't be nothing like that. Tim was able to walk up to King Von and put holes in him. Remember that part. Tim was able to walk up on King Von and shoot him. It wasn't like he was sitting in the back of the truck and started aiming it, firing and all that. Nah, bro, got up close and put them holes in him. So it's all on because it's people. But I asked y'all this simple question. If it was the other way around, wouldn't y'all be praising it? If it was King Von getting stole on, getting sucker punched, because that's what he did. He sucker punched Quando Rondo. If it was King Von getting sucker punched by Quando Rondo, and then Quando Rondo's homie start jumping King Von, and King Von's homie turn around and kill Quando Rondo, wouldn't we be saying something completely different? Just putting it out there. They both documented gangbangers, gang members. I'll let y'all decide. Y'all share to keep your people aware. Subscribe. Turn on that bell to stay notified. Check out the last video that I did, bro. Crazy. Uh, it, it is what it is. I'm not celebrating anything like that. But be aware of your surroundings and know where you at. And that's what I'm going to pin in the comments. Definitely check out that last video. But until then, I'll catch you on the next one. <laughs> yeah. Come on, man. King AK-47 is another one. Seti Nash, them dudes jump me on the internet. What's really hood when I'm through the hood? Nothing be said, we got it overstood. The team fed, yeah, it's really good. Put that on everything, bro, you're never good. What's really hood when I'm through the hood? Nothing be said, we got it overstood. Ch channels, the Seti Nashes and, and uh, AK-47s, all the rest of these should block them. Don't even erase their comments. Straight block them out of my shit. You're not even going to mention these niggas' names in my platform. Straight block them out.